Okay, so this we are going to solve this one as an example on the circular disk map. So as what we have been doing already, we need to graph the given function. This example we are given the function y equals square root of x okay and this is actually a parabola that opens to the right but since merong square root it's only a half parabola so this is y equals square root of x and then we are bounded until x equals 4 and dito x equals 4 Okay, and then we are going to rotate this bounded region, itong region na ito, okay? And then, we ro rotate natin siya dito sa x-axis. So, to do, to do this, basically, uh, mangyayari dito, iro rotate natin itong buong area na ito about this x-axis. We don't need to do that, okay? So, ang gagawin lang natin, to construct, a rectangle at itong rectangle na ito ang i-rotate natin. Okay, isang rectangle lang i-rotate natin from x equals 0 to x equals 4. Ba ang formula natin for the volume, the volume is just equal to pi and then integral of y squared dx dx kasi uh, dx naman itong thickness ng circular disk natin and y is actually the radius of the circular disk as explained in the previous video and we are going to evaluate this one from 0 to 4 and this is already the volume we have already set up the integral so evaluate na lang so pi y squared dx so we need to since dx x yung variable of integration natin papalitan natin yung y squared in terms of x and to do that we just need our equation so this is basically square root of x squared so that is x x then we evaluate na lang natin so pi is x squared over 2 okay then evaluate natin yan from 0 from 0 to 4 so since constant naman yung pi over 2 labas na natin yung pi over 2 so this is 4 squared minus pi over 2 multiplied by 16 okay so base uh ang sagot natin ay 8 pi cubic cube. And this is actually uh, consistent with the answer from the book. This is actually from. Kung titignan natin madali lang ano ang paggamit when we are given the circular disk. If you have any question about this one, please let me know. Okay.